access to finance, financial inclusion and digitalization are unanimously some of the key catalysts of economic development and social welfare. It is in this spirit that World Relief in partnership with the United Nations Capital Development Fund UNCDF and M. Van Finte Company in April 2020 came up with Digital Savings for Life project, a project that sought to promote financial literacy and inclusion and access to finance especially among refugee camps host communities, women and youth. Operating in three districts across Rwanda, namely Karongi, Gatsibo and Yichumbi districts, the project came to bridge the gap in the country's digital and financial ecosystem. The Digital uh, Savings for Life project uh, was birthed out of the need that we are seeing in the community. We were seeing uh, the low income, the financially excluded people um, really lacking the opportunity to access the digital financial uh, services. We were seeing that uh, there was a need uh, for them to uh, benefit and they were definitely asking for these uh, services. Then the other is uh, what we are seeing, uh, the country level where the nation is driving towards a cashless uh, economy and we thought that uh, that would be another uh, opportunity. But also uh, it was at a point when COVID-19 was really starting to hit uh, not only Rwanda but um, uh, all over the world and we realized that uh, we needed to come up with a quick solution that could uh, help uh, people in the community to continuously uh, transact financially with a digital um, platform. Meanwhile, Roserine Wamahoro, who is the program coordinator at UNCDF, says that there is a need to scale the project at a national level. In terms of opportunities that we think as uh, UNCDF, we think the project can be scaled at a bigger national level because not only looking at the targeted population before, saying uh, refugees and host communities, focusing at uh, the vulnerable population in a whole, whereby if they are grouped in savings group, if they access digital literacy, if they are using uh, uh, fintech, financial technology, to do their daily transaction, it, help, it help, can help them, specifically now after the impact of COVID-19. According to MVAND, a technology solutions provider for software and applications development, Digital Savings for Life project has increased trust and transparency in community-based saving groups. Chambere nuko ikora na buhanga ryazanye umucyo mu matsinda ubu umunyamuryango ashobora kumenya abizigamye bose amafaranga itsinda rimaze kugeza amafaranga we amaze kugeza mu itsinda atabanje kubaza umubitsi bakanamenya nabantu bafashe inguzanyo mu itsinda noneho bikabafasha gukorera mu mucyo no kwizerana kumenya yuko between April 2020 and July 2021, 178 digital saving groups were created, serving 3,351 members thanks to Digital Savings for Life project. <laughs> Mamu nadie mukwizi kama kwikora na buhanga nigeze njya mu ryo muno kibaranya mbiri bihumbi 20 arayatanze baranayandika barayaryagi kigeze cyo kugabana uwayabitse arayabura turamurega biranga bigeze wo turayareka yamaranye imyaka itatu ariko kwikora na buhanga ntabwo bakwambura kuko abari kuri telefone yawe kandi wabasha kuyabikuza ntabwo byashoboka kwikora na buhanga iyo umuntu abashije kugira ikibazo abasha kuguza amafaranga bakayamuha akokanya ariko kwizigamira mu dutabo 
ho hajya habona kanimbogamizi wasanga umuntu niba muhaya amafaranga kuje haraba bika amafaranga mu buryo butandukanye harimo abayabika mu ngo abandi bakaba bayabika mu mahembe ariko icyo nababwira nuko kwizigamira ku ikorana buhanga umuntu afite ubwishingizi cyangwa se afite ikizere yuko ya mafaranga hari nta wayiba nta cyayahungabanya bityo umutekano wayo ukaba wizewe Through all the span of Digital Savings for Life project 6872 community members benefited These include 3351 doing transactions digitally and 3521 members from traditional groups who were trained on digital and financial literacy. Overall, 61% of members transacting digitally are female, while 31% are youth aged between 18 and 24. Watumye twigirira ikizere tubasha kwiteza imbere. Waraje injyamunguza amafaranga mu 15 yagenda ngo urimbuto z'ibirayi biro 140 nyeze biro 200. Maze kweza biro 200 ngo ramwihumbe 140. Ngo za ndongera nya mwitse ndangu zihumbe 145 biba biba ibintu 185. Hari ibintu bihumbi 20 nari mfite mu kumu nagiye najya gusura kechuru atekira amafaranga ze kugure ndazi nkayabika nyo ay 9 pitimo makumyabiri ku ruhande kuri ibyo 85 nari mfite nyongeraho nguri mashine bihombirana ngubu ndadoda nise niba nshaka sabune niba nshaka kugura umwenda nakomanza kusaba abateyi cyangwa ikindi kintu cyose basha kukibonera Nabuka ko ajya rimwe gisubira. Ku myaka 2024 nabashije kuba na ujamo hanyuma maze kujamo kubera ko mwitsinda tubasha kugurizwa noneho nakama inguzanyo mbasha kuba nagura ingurube bwa mbere nguza nagujije mu 15 ngura ingurube maze kugura ingurube ndashaka gushaka aho nakura amafaranga yo kwishyura genda nshaka ibiraka amafaranga ndayishyura nano maze kwishyura nongira nguza indi nguzanyo ya kabiri maze kuyiguza nongira ngura indi ngurube kubera ko ya mbere nabonye yororoka neza kuraya amafaranga rero yo kunguzanya ya kabiri kuyarasigaye basha no kongera kugura inkoko eshanu zimfasha mu buryo bwo kwizigamira ni nkoko zitera amagi umushinga ikintu wamariye na wudiye mwikora na buhanga nyene ryo kwizigama maze kurijyamo ubwo bwa mbere nguza mu bihumbi 30 ndangura ibirayi ibiri shana na mirongo itanu bijyana mu nkambi hajya nunguka nkabona yo kwizigama nkabona nayo kwishyura nkabona nayo guhahisha muri make baye nyifite ubuzima ngihagaze numva na nakomeza nkakora nane nkakoresha ikora na buhanga azagira icyo ngeraho no korora dutungo tugufiya dushobotse no kuba na fatanya n'umuryango tugashaka ahantu tubaheza ibyo byose ubuzima bugakomeza Je nkuru byiru ku kintu byamariye nuko ryatumye niteza imbere tumaze kugabana nakiri ibihumbi 53 yagura mu mashini cyo kogosha bimariye nuko mbasha kubona ngo amafaranga nizigama kandi nubundi ngafite indi numbere yo kuzagira ikindi nzakora eh tukimara kugabana nahawe ibihumbi 26 
ndagenda nguramo umurima muhingamo icyayi eh icyo cyayi rero kizakimpa amafaranga buri kwezi ngarura mu itsinda ko no buri tsinda ntabwo narivuyemo ndacyari komeje cyo nabwira abadafite gahunda yo kwitabira kuzigama nabashirikaze kuyango baze kwizigama kuko ibyo wizigamye eh ugira icyo ugeraho wizigama make make ugazasoza itsinda ufite menshi ku buryo wa guri tungo cyangwa se ukagura n'ikindi gikoresho cyakuteza imbere according to rose niwe mwana a district official in Karongi district digital savings for life project came at the right time nimushingo agiza kamaro kenshi cyane muri akarere kacu abo muntu dukurikije ibyo twashoye kugana n'abantu twaje twiboneye kuri tere abaturage bacu bashoye ufata inguzanyo zirenda miliyoni 12 bari kenura hagurwa inka Mtoje nashe kwigurira inka haguri ngurube serenga 80 inkoko zirenga igihumbi nkwavu zira muri esheshatu intama ni hene harabashe gukora no cyuruzi buciriritse bagera muri 52 ndetse hanashe kwirira za mitwere bahira abana amashuri nibyo nanababwiye mu gihe twari muri guma mu rugo cyo cyo covid 19 cyamaze kutugeraho abantu bari mbasinda nka ibazo bagize cyane nk'abantu batari mu matsinda Mutura gitari tabira kuzigama muri rusange kintu nkamubwira cyambere nuko ari marahomba ari marahomba kuko kwizigamira nta ushaka gutereza gutera imbere utisigamira ikintu buryo umuntu ashora icyo yasigame byatweretse yuko burya no mutura giteka ko dafite ubushobozi burya arabufite ahubwo nuko atazi kwa bufite abashije kwizigamira amaki ashoboka mu gihe runaka ashaka gukora gashinga ashaka buri tungo ashaka gukemura ikibazo cyo mu rugo ariko wa wundi utizigamira iyo habaye akabazo gatoya usanga ayo wicyo yako ariko uri mwitsindi n'ibyo gize ikibazo nta mafaranga ufite wawe mu rugo ugana itsinda rika kugoboka ugashaka gukemura bya ibazo byawe none uko dasigara wishyura as it is the case for several other projects there were several challenges encountered along the way to implementing digital savings for life project however in response to the challenges many measures were taken areas of improvement are majorly around uh, community mobilization and continuous effort to educate our people on the need for digital and financial uh, solutions that uh, there is uh, trust uh, on these solutions but also that they are equipped to understand uh, what is uh, a right solution what that is going to really uh, meet their need i think there's still a need to capacitate and uh, equip our people in the communities that they are aware of the benefits and uh, they can make their own choice around the different um, opportunities that uh, come to them uh, the other area of uh, improvement uh, is going to be around um, the cash out fees which continuously uh, are a challenge uh, to the people but uh, we are finding different ways to really uh, encourage uh, them to understand that uh, to have a digital solution it will come with a small fee but also uh, working with the different uh, mobile network operators and the fintech to creatively and the financial service providers to come up with uh, affordable ways to help um, the low income earners and the financially excluded to not uh, see the cash out fees as a limitation but uh, in a way that is uh, affordable and meaningful to uh, them Meanwhile, according to Ward Relief, the project could not have been successful without the unwavering support from all partners, including the government of Rwanda. The success of uh, this project has been uh, dependent uh, on uh, great collaboration that we've seen uh, between uh, UNCDF, MVEND and World Relief, but overall uh, the great uh, support that we've received from the government of Rwanda by creating a really an enabling environment for us uh, in the community. So uh, we want to thank uh, very much um, the people of Kajeo, the people of Jichumbi, and uh, also the people of Gatsibo sector within Gatsibo district and the people of Gwangwa within Karonji district that uh, they trusted us when we reached out to them and introduced um, the digital and financial literacy services that they were willing to accept and trust us uh, with that uh, service that we wanted to provide to them uh, but also want to thank um, MVEND 
uh, for their continuous effort around a provision of technical uh, support and the wonderful um, guidance that we received from our UNCDF and the resources that they really provide to make all this uh, possible. We are forever grateful for UNCDF's partnership and uh, not only the financial resources, but the technical guidance that uh, uh, they gave us. And lastly, I'll thank the World Relief staff that were behind uh, this uh, on the field and making sure that uh, the people we all want to see lives changed, that they did their best and supported them uh, to make sure that uh, this project was a, a success. So thank you so much. Uh, you all for your um, efforts. Word Relief, United Nations Capital Development Fund UNCDF and MVEN Fintech Company say they are convinced the gains from Digital Savings for Life project will be sustained because beneficiaries are aware of the benefits of digital saving groups and another reason being the fact that the government of Rwanda has several policies in place that aim to enhance access to finance, financial inclusion and digitalization.